uh, welcome. Uh, we are very happy to present um, our melodic platform, which can be used for automatic serverless deployment and management. Uh, the presentation will be performed by uh, Alicia Reniewicz, who uh, Alicia will lead the practical session. Uh, Alicia. Hello, everyone. Uh, I am Alicia Reniewicz, and I am team leader in Melodic Project. Uh, and myself, Paweł Skrzypek, I am a cloud computing architect and uh, architect of the, of the solution of the Melodic platform. Uh, the first question is, what is the Melodic? Uh, uh, it is the single universal platform for deploying application uh, into the multi-cloud. Melodic is able to deploy application to the Azure, Amazon, Google Cloud, OpenStack-based providers, as well as some small uh, local cloud providers. It's done automatically and it's um, optimized. Uh, a very big advantage of the melodic is ability to deploy not only the serverless component, but of course or, uh, also serverless, but also the virtual machines, containers, uh, big data application um, uh, in fully optimized manner. Usually the application contains not only the serverless components, uh, so the ability to deploy different type of the components uh, allows to use that platform in for the practical business systems uh, to optimize the, the deployment. Uh, Melodic is fully open source, so you could download Melodic and start using Melodic. The link to the download will be at the end of the presentation. We are also very welcome to, to contact us. We can help uh, and support the usage of the, of the Melodic platform. Uh, why to use Melodic? The first reason is that probably it is the simplest and most easy way to use the multi-cloud approach. Uh, it allows to unified way to deploy virtual machines, containers, serverless, and big data Spark cluster to the different cloud providers in fully automatic uh, way. Uh, the big unique um, Advantage of the Melodic is the ability to deploy, uh, to optimize the usage of the cloud resources. So Melodic uh, can choose the most optimal set of the resources and deploy application accordingly. I will tell about that later. And key features of the Melodic. The first most important is automatic deployment of the application. Uh, the second one is, as I mentioned, the ability to select optimal uh, deployment uh, and it is done continuously. I will show that on the, on the diagram. Uh, support for big data frameworks and also data locality. So usually it is very difficult to move a big data set big data databases in the cloud. Uh, so Melodic is aware of that and could deploy the components near the given data location. Uh, Melodic uses central authentication and authorization and also have has um, incorporated advanced and flexible security rules based on the XML, XACML and Balana and is enterprise ready. It uses enterprise uh, service pass uh, MuleSoft to communicate between the components and it is uh, based also on the BPM paradigm. Allow the, we are using the BPM process to orchestrate invocation of the components and it could be very easy changed by the user according to the needs. <coughs> The fundamental point of the Melodic is CAMEL, Cloud Application Modeling and Execution Language. It is the language which allows us to uh, define the application, uh, 
in some points similar, for example, to the uh, Terraform or to the uh, cloud formation, but the very unique ability of the camel is um, ability to not only uh, describe the infrastructure, but also to describe the application and the requirements of the application, how many cores, how many memory it should use. And based on that, the model of the application is translated to the mathematical form, which can be optimized using advanced uh, solvers, both deterministic one and also the, uh, the machine learning uh, one. Thanks to that, uh, Melodic is the only platform which is able to automatically to select the most optimal cloud provider and select the most optimal uh, cloud resources. And it's fully multi-cloud, so you define your model once and can deploy to the uh, different cloud automatically. Okay. Uh, the strongest point of the melody is optimization and automation. The user needs to set the only prepare the deployment model, set the parameter of the application, and then the whole process is done automatically. So Melody calculate the initial um, optimal deployment, then deploy application to the selected cloud providers, then start metric collections and monitoring application. And based on the value of the metrics, Melody calculate new deployment and decide if the application should be redeployed or not based on the current values of the metrics. Uh, all of that loop is done for fully automatically, so Melody continuously uh, monitor application and redeploy application. Uh, Melodic has also built in uh, event management system, so it's able to collect all possible metrics uh, from the application in the real time. It is also possible to add custom business metrics to be uh, able to track the business performance of, of the application, not only the technical one. Uh, and uh, how Melodic decide what is the best de deployment. Uh, Melodic uh, collect the metrics of the running application, and then calculate so-called utility function. For each application, it is possible to define the utility function, which in fact says what is the best deployment for that application. Usually, the best deployment is the uh, combination of the saving costs, having the enough performance, high availability, security, and so on. And we could uh, define the balance between these factors in the given utility function. Uh, also, melodic focus on the business value. So we can measure the CPU and memory, but we could measure also the average response to the user, average time of the job processing, and other more business related uh, metrics. And based on that, selects the best deployment. And as I said, it is the trade off between the cost which we want to minimize, and performance availability, which we want to maximize, and other possible metrics. Uh, we will show uh, how Merodic works. Uh, I will show in a few minutes. Uh, based on the image recognition application, it is the application which uh, is used for the um, real-time image uh, and face recognition, for example, on the airport security and so on. Uh, and first step is to deploy the, the, the function. Uh, then deployed function classified Im images and decide if the image is recognized or not. Uh, then uh, it is deployed of the Spark application worker and estimate the completion time. Uh, more details uh, about the application will be uh, said by Ala during the, the presentation. Uh, 
uh, melodic workflow look uh, looks like follow. Uh, the first step is to model application in camera language, as we said. Uh, then the second step is to deploy melodic platform itself, then submit Camel model to the melodic, uh, and then push the green button start deployment of the application. In that uh, point, all of the steps done by Melodic uh, will be performed. And I will show that uh, on live and then connect to your application and, and enjoy. Okay, that's all about the Melodic. Now we can switch to the live presentation. Ala, please take a lead of that. I will stop sharing. And now I would like to present you a demo of our serverless application. Uh, deployment done automatically by Melodic. Uh, my Melodic platform is installed on a virtual machine on AWS. It is up and running. I'm logged uh, in. The first step uh, in Melodic usage is the defining of cloud settings. In provider settings part, uh, we, have we have definitions for all pro providers used by us. In these definitions, we provide cloud credentials and uh, properties uh, for example, settings for Amazon Security Group or a set of private images. Uh, when our platform is properly configured, we can go to deployment bookmark. Uh, today, I would like to deploy application, which is named face uh, recognition. Uh, as Pavel said, it can uh, recognize people from photos based on previously performed training and machine learning. Before deployment, we need to model our application with its requirements in Camel model, which is human understandable and editable form. After that, such model is transformed uh, to XMI format, form understandable for Melodic. Uh, we upload this XMI file to our platform uh, by drag and drop. And now our model is being validated. And after that, it will be saved in database. In a moment, I will be asked for field values of AWS developers uh, uh, credentials. Providing these credentials is required in order to save results of our application in AWS free bucket and in order to run Lambda functions. Uh, but in view of security reasons, we shouldn't put them directly in camera model file. Uh, in this case, it's not the first upload of such model on this virtual machine. So these variables already exist in dedicated secure store. I can verify them, update if they were changed and save. Um, after that, I need to choose uh, which application I want to deploy and which cloud providers I want to use. Uh, in that case, we would like to deploy face recognition only on AWS. So we choose only these uh, properties. Thanks to them, Melodic has credentials for this provider. Now I can go to the next step and start uh, the process of deployment. The first step in our deployment process is fetching offers. We have information about current total number of offers from previously selected providers. So in this case from AWS, 
uh, from these offers, Melodic will choose the best solution for all of our three components of this application, two Lambda functions and one virtual machine. Uh, after choosing um, fetching offers box, uh, we are directed to view of all currently available offers. Uh, there are clouds, hardware, locations, and list of uh, our uh, images. Our offers are still fetching. Uh, the next step of process uh, will be generating constraint problem. Constraint problem is generated based on our requirements defined in camel model. Uh, in simple process view, there are visualized all variables from camel model uh, with the domain values. This application is built from two serverless functions, one for model training, it calls train lambda, and the second one for real application performance, so for uh, recognizing of faces, and it is named recognize lambda. For uh, training uh, of this application, uh, we need data and they are get from Amazon S3 bucket. Uh, all of these settings are configured in our camel model. Also, we have several components dedicated for user. It enables uploading of images to perform process of recognizing. Uh, for this application, uh, as variables, we will see cardinalities and providers for all uh, of these components. Uh, in detailed view of our constraint problem, we have list of all uh, of these uh, variables. Utility formula, it is used for measured uh, utility of each possible solutions and choose the best one. In this case, we use default formula, so we want to optimize only costs of our application. Also, we have here a list of constants, uh, which is used in melodic calculations, and uh, it comes from user requirements. And list of metrics, which will be uh, used to optimize our application deployment. Uh, in this case, we haven't defined any metrics, but of course we can do that. Uh, I back to process view. Uh, when constant problem is generated, it is time for reasoning. Melodic finds here the best, the most profitable solution for the problem defined by us. When rezoning is completed, we can observe information uh, about calculated solution, utility value, and values for each variables. In that case, one uh, as cardinality for all of components and provider for all of them from zero index, so uh, AWS provider. The next step in process deployment is deploying. Uh, here Melodic performs operations based on calculated solution. This solution uh, is deployed. For each application component, Melodic creates proper instances uh, and in case of uh, a reconfiguration process, it can delete or uh, remains 
some, uh, some components. Our application is deployed. So we can check the result in your application part. Uh, in the virtual machine part, uh, we can see our web server uh, and we have all information about this instance. So state, uh, IP addresses, provider and location and also a possibility of SSH connection. On the functions list, we can see uh, our two Lambda functions. So uh, recognize Lambda and train Lambda uh, with information about them. So about provider, location, memory, runtime and stack. Also in AWS console, uh, in uh, EC2 service, we can see new, uh, new virtual machine of our web server. And in Lambda service, we can see two new uh, Lambda functions created two minutes ago. Recognize Lambda and train Lambda. To sum up, we could see how Melodic supports serverless application deployment. After modeling of our application, it is done fully automatically. That's it from my side in part of our uh, demo of application. Uh, thank you, Alicia. Uh, I hope that uh, you will find the presentation interesting and uh, because you can see how to use Melodic that in, in practice, yeah, to deploy application, to see that is really deployed in the optimized way uh, and yeah, the very important benefit is to be able to deploy different time type of the components uh, virtual machines containers serverless from the from the one application as i said the melodic is fully open source so it can be downloaded uh, uh, from the melodic cloud page here is the link uh, also, if you want to use Melodic, please contact us and we can support um, using Melodic and, and help with that. Uh, I hope you have found that presentation interesting and uh, uh, you will soon start to deploy serverless component into multi-cloud using Melodic. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. <laughs>